Hey peeps, we are back. We are talking what would the peeps do? And this one is called Home Office. Hey, before we get into the video, please do me the honors of subscribing to my channel, hitting the notification bell so you can always be notified when I post new content, hitting the thumbs up because that does wonders for my channel, and share. Thanks. All right, so here we go. She is a 32 year old woman who has begun working from home two months ago. She says, my husband brought the house that we live in before we got together. He calls it his property, which is fine with me. The house is small and only has two rooms, one of which used to be empty until I started using it as my home office for my work from home job. All was going fine with my job till he sat down last night saying he expected 30% profit from whatever I get from my job since he provides the office for my work. I was completely caught off guard by this. I asked if he was serious and he went on about it being his home and how he could use this room for his own purpose since it's his property. I said no and called him unreasonable, which led to a blow up. I yelled at him saying he won't get a penny and he pitched a fit and accused me of taking full advantage. Even though there's no mortgage to be paid, I do all the chores in the house as well as share the bills. I pay half. He got his family involved in this and they're split. His mom thinks I'm being difficult and that 30% is not a huge amount and that room is providing stability for my work from home and my husband should get some sort of benefit. Am I an ass for putting my foot down and refusing to give him a penny? Um, no, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Um, my opinion is she is not an ass, but her husband and her mother-in-law absolutely are. There is no way in hell that I'm going to be married to you living in this house while you continue to call it your house, your property. If I am your wife, shouldn't this be our home? Shouldn't I feel comfortable in this home? And if I'm doing all the chores and paying half the bills, now you want me to give you 30% of my paycheck because I'm using a room in the house that I live in? This is ridiculous. I would absolutely stop paying bills, save up my money and move the hell out. Dude, this is over. What kind of marriage is this? I would not give him one damn dime. I mean, he is unreasonable and so is his mother. And he is letting her know that this is his house, this is his situation, which means at any point, if he doesn't wanna deal with you, he could throw you out. There's no stability in this relationship. His mom saying that this office provides her stability for her work from home, but where is the stability of the marriage? Your house, your room, 30%? Boy, you got to be kidding me. I mean, shit. I would tell him, okay, okay, sure, you can get 30%. As soon as you start paying me for all the chores I do around the house, and as soon as you start paying me for the good sex. Okay, where's my money? You want money for me using this office to make money to pay half the bills around here. So give me money for cleaning the house. Give me money for the sex. Because it seems like this marriage is just transactional. This is a bunch of bullshit. Save your 30% for the lawyers for the divorce. I would divorce him and see if I could take half of the house. Make him have to sell it. You know what I mean? Give me half of the house since you want to be such a jackass. I don't know what the state laws are, but I don't want a transactional marriage. That is a nightmare. Give you 30%. I mean, can you imagine if she has children with him? What the hell would happen then? Oh no, uh-uh girl, this relationship is over. Say goodbye. I would absolutely be hoarding my money so that I can move the hell out. As a matter of fact, I would just move in with my mama ASAP. Boy, we done. You don't have to worry about this little tiny ass house in this tiny ass room. I'm out. I'm just saying. Anyway, peeps, get down in the comments and let me know what you think. And until next time, bye. <laughs>